Hi everyone, so first video review for this week is for Part of Her Plan by Catherine Peace. Um, for those of you that want to check out my review, I have just posted that, so if you're on YouTube there's a link in the description below, and if you're on Facebook or on my blog there's a link within the post. And this is the video review, so Part of Her Plan by Catherine Peace. Um, it was a really emotional journey, it was like one of those full on emotional stories that you go on a journey with the characters. So um, it's about Jenny, she's desperate to come home. So um, she tries to convince her brother that she's no longer drinking and um, when she kind of gets her own way and she gets back she's convinced that she doesn't need anyone um, but her family until she runs into Lydia who, she's know, who she knows from the past. So um, Jenny finds herself living um, in the same house that Lydia um, is living in and her attraction to uh, Lydia and their connection um, from the past sort of complicates things. And so then Lydia worries um, that Jenny's sort of return to her life is going to threaten all her carefully laid plans because both of them are dealing um, with the aftermath of addiction and everything that's going on. So there's a lot to be disrupted. Um, so as I say, it's a very emotional story, but it's also very moving as well. Um, the characters, they have very similar experiences, but very different views and outcomes um, following their battles with addiction. They're, they're both... They're, they're in that same place, but they have completely different view on it, which is great because you're seeing both sides. You're seeing someone who really wants to help themselves and someone who isn't sure they want to help themselves or doesn't want to let that go a little bit. So that's really nice to get that contrast between the two of them. So it's a kind of sweet story um, rather than focusing on the darker elements. Um, it touched lightly on them and it was very sensitive when it did. Uh, so that built the connection between the reader and the characters um, while exploring it was more about exploring the character's own growth and self-discovery. They were, they were learning a lot about themselves as you were learning about them as character. So I didn't know what to expect from the story. And um, when I started reading it, I, was, I wasn't sure where it was going to go. But I thoroughly, thoroughly enjoyed it. And Catherine's written one of those stories that um, you can just really revel in and enjoy. You can really get involved and understand and see and experience that character growth and journey and development. So I really like that. And the conflict um, is not only between the characters, which is clever as well, it's the self-inflicted conflict. So um, that leaves all that room for the development and growth because they're telling themselves one thing, telling people another thing. Their own mind is conflicting um, in thought as is their actions and what they're actually doing. So that's a really interesting sort of take on it and um, you can just really immerse yourself in, in, in their journey. So I really love that um, and you really do feel like you're there with them. Um, you're, you're there through the ups, the downs, you learn to appreciate the mistakes, uh, same as they do, and the life lessons that they're encountering on the way. There's a lot of growth and development in there and there's a lot that you can sort of take personally and, and learn from as well as the same time as the characters are. Um, so this is part of a series, but what's really nice is the story is completely standalone, so you don't have to have read anything else in the series, and you can enjoy it without having to have all that background knowledge of characters and, and everything. So I love that it's part of a series that's all standalone, and um, I really enjoyed the story. I did actually find it quite addictive, if you will pardon the pun. <laughs> um, so I hope that Catherine will bring um, future stories with Lydia and Jenny because they're very interesting characters and I would love to see how they've developed beyond where they got to in this story. Um, but it's a really edgy, unexpected um, and slightly different type of romance. It's, it's got highly charged emotional moments, cute moments, heartbreaking moments and you will be left feeling very emotional when you read this. So I highly recommend the book um, and I look forward to reading more from Catherine in the future. Um, but in the meantime I'll pop a link in the description so you can go and grab a copy of Part of Her Plan by Catherine Peace which I hope you will. Uh, if you've read Part of Her Plan I would love to hear your thoughts so please comment below, please let me know what you thought of the book. Um, and if you haven't read it yet but you're planning on reading it, something to be read list, or, you, or you're thinking, I really want to read that book now. And um, again, it would be great to hear your thoughts um, and what you're interested in reading. So um, I really hope you enjoy it and I hope you have a great week. Bye.